2004, two faculty members with the Indiana University School of Medicine conceptualized and did initial development work on a new patient record system to support one of the largest HIV AIDS health systems in Western Kenya. The Open Medical Record System, OpenMRS, has a mission to improve healthcare delivery in resource constrained environments by working together as a global community to create a robust, scalable, user driven open source medical record system platform. I'm a software engineer with Partners in Health since 2004. Partners in Health has been involved with OpenMRS from the beginning. Ten years ago, a team of four, Hamish Fraser, Darius Jazieri, Sharon Choi, and myself, were developing and supporting three different systems. PIH was expanding into three countries in Africa, and a homegrown system built by a small team was untenable. Hamish returned from a meeting with Paul and Burke and was so enthusiastic to have found like-minded clinicians and medical informatics experts who are trying to solve many of the same problems. In the future, I hope that OpenMRS will continue to improve point-of-care healthcare, useful alerts and reports to clinicians, simplify customization, and further integration with laboratory and mobile systems. My name is Matthew Samakade, working with Masaka Regional Referral Hospital, found in Masaka, Uganda, as the data manager. I and my team have used OpenMRS for seven years now. Uh, we use we use OpenMRS for patient management and research, and we have realized lots and lots of benefits from using OpenMRS. Some of which include uh, easy follow-up of patient progress, less time spent on documenting patient records, better care for patients. OpenMRS has participated annually as a mentoring organization in Google Summer of Code since 2007 and is a new mentoring organization in Google Code in 2014. My name is Alex Duc from France. I'm a student at Inside de Lyon, studying computer science and telecommunication engineering. I get involved with OpenMRS in March 2014, and I become a Google Summer of Code student, working on OpenMRS at Atlas with Burke Mamlin. In 2013, OpenMRS also participated as a mentoring organization in the Outreach Program for Women. OpenMRS holds hackathons, implementer meetings, code jams, camps, and a worldwide summit starting in 2015. That is licensed under the OpenMRS public license based on the Mozilla public license is a Java based web application that can run on laptops in small clinics or on large servers for nationwide use. OpenMRS is supported by core teams from Partners in Health, Regan Streif Institute, and the South African Medical Research Council. I'm Darius Jazieri, and I was on the Partners in Health team that co founded OpenMRS 10 years ago. At PIH, we love OpenMRS because it's such a flexible platform. We've been able to use it to build all sorts of medical record applications. We've used it in Rwanda, Haiti, Lesotho, Malawi, and Peru. We've done HIV, TB, other chronic care, We've done primary care research studies, and more. These days, I'm working with ThoughtWorks on an OpenMRS Ebola system for Save the Children in Sierra Leone. Other organizations that collaborate on OpenMRS are the Millennium Villages Project, and Baobab Health Systems. My name is Dr. Andy Cantor, and I'm Assistant Professor of Clinical Biomedical Informatics and Clinical Epidemiology at Columbia University in New York City. We began working with OpenMRS in 2007 as part of the Millennium Villages Project. OpenMRS was perfectly designed to allow MVP to work within its 10 different countries with 10 different languages and 10 different ministries of health, and yet still have interoperable and shareable information. The concept dictionary, when combined with the template engine and the ability to integrate with mobile devices, allowed MVP to work within these 10 different countries in Africa. The Millennium Village Project supported OpenMRS because OpenMRS was the center of the Millennium Village's global network, which was an integrated open source information system. One of the main reasons that we chose OpenMRS for MVP was its standardized concept dictionary. However, when we joined the community back in 2007, there really was no one supporting the dictionary for everyone. 
Uh, so part of the Columbia International eHealth Laboratory and Millennium Villages Project job was essentially to provide this standardized dictionary for most of the use cases that um, we were seeing in the developing world and uh, to some extent in the developed world. MVP is happy to have worked with and support OpenMRS and we are confident that if the next 10 years are anything like the last 10 years, OpenMRS will continue to be a major success. We are grateful for all the support we've received from the community and we hope that in some way we've been able to get back. OpenMRS healthcare professionals have up-to-date patient health records literally at their fingertips. And OpenMRS iOS app and Android app are available for free download. OpenMRS has won the International Linux Medical News Freedom Award and has received the Free Software Award for projects of social benefit. From a humble solution for a problem in a small town in Africa, OpenMRS has grown to become one of the largest health IT projects on the planet. So. Here's the first 10 years of OpenMRS. 10 years. 10 years. 10 years. Happy anniversary, anniversary OpenMRS. We don't want to build it ourselves and then give it to the community as free software. We want it to be developed by the community. Happy anniversary, OpenMRS.